Hi angels, welcome back to my channel. If it's a question of my love, you got it. Don't belong to no one else but you. If it's a question of my heart, you got it. Cause baby, I got plans for you. <laughs> hey you guys, I just wanted to welcome you back to my channel with a little bit of love. So that's the song, The Matrimony by Wale and Usher. I absolutely love that song and I figured it just fit right in with today's topic of the video. Today, I just wanted to have a fun video you guys and talk about, of course, our love for handbags, but also our love for our boo things, our main squeeze, our husbands, our wives, you know, whoever that person is to you, that special person, your sweetheart, your baby daddy, <laughs> your friend, your girlfriend, your lover, whoever that special person is, because you guys know we're talking about handbags here and I just wanted to talk about how you guys know I'm a sister that works hard for my money. All of us are. We all work very hard for the finer and the nice things in life, including these handbags. However, every once in a while, every once in a while, don't you do the baby, baby, please. Don't you do the baby, baby, please buy me that bag. <laughs> Every once in a while for your birthday or for Christmas, Valentine's Day, whatever that special day is, every once in a while we might, you know, want a bag and our significant other might treat us to the bag. That's happened to all of us, you guys. As much as, like I said, we're hardworking women and men and we work hard for some of the finer things in life and some of our handbags, every once in a while we ask for that bag. Or even if we don't ask for it, our significant others play a big role in our handbag addiction and in our handbag collecting because they contribute to our addiction, you guys. Every once in a while, they treat us to a bag. So today, I just wanted to talk a little bit about that. I just wanted to talk about my honey and my special boo thing in my life and how he sometimes go ahead and treats me and treats me special. So basically, you guys know, these two bags right here are Louis Vuitton bags. I absolutely love them in my collection. However, I've had this bag, the Multicolor Speedy, a couple of times. This is my second go round with this bag. This is my second go round with this beautiful Multicolor Speedy. And I absolutely love this one in my collection. So the first time I got this bag, I ended up purchasing it from Fashion File. And it was one of those cases where you guys know how on Fashion File, the website, the bags come in, and when they come in, you have a five-day wait period before you can go ahead and put the bag in layaway. If you decide to go ahead and purchase the bag, you can purchase it outright, but if you want to put the, the item in layaway, you have to wait five whole days. So during that whole five-day period, sometimes, you know, you're watching the bag, you put the heart on the bag, and then you just see on Fashion File, you see that heart number multiply and multiply and multiply. It'll go from one to two to three people liking the bag. The next thing you know, it'll be 23 people. 45 people liking the handbag that you're thinking about purchasing. So every once in a while, you know, you might either save for a purchase or, you know, it might be something that you decide to purchase on your own. Or every once in a while, you might ask your honey, go ahead and help me out with that purchase. So, you know, when that happens, we have to, you know, sometimes call in the heavy, the heavy hitter and sometimes say, baby, baby, please, I got to have it. The world is crumbling down around me. The walls are falling down around me if I don't have that handbag. So that was the case the first time when I purchased this particular multicolor speedy bag. That was the case. I saw it and I wanted it. I drooled over it for many years and I wanted it so bad in my handbag collection that the first time around, my honey ended up treating me to it and I was so, so happy about that. Now, I ended up wanting a different color scheme on this multicolor Speedy bag. You guys know the Louis Vuitton multicolor Speedy comes with a variety of different colors on it. So the first time I had this lovely bag, I had a lot of beautiful yellow in it. And that was the one that, like I said, my sweetheart treated me to. This time around, I ended up purchasing this bag myself and I purchased it 
from an Instagram consignment store. Shout out to Marquee Luxury. You girls know, I'm sure you've seen on Instagram. If you haven't seen them before, go ahead and check out Marquee Luxury on Instagram. I'll have all the information down below. I went ahead and I picked up this beauty from an online consignment shop with Instagram called Marquee Luxury, and it is a beautiful bag. But this is one bag that, like I said, initially for me to go ahead and obtain it, I asked my honey to go ahead and treat me for it the first time around, and then the second time around, I purchased it myself. So the second handbag that I wanted to talk about was none other than my Louis Vuitton duffel right here. So this is my keep all, my bandolier, 40, I'm sorry, this is my 50. Now I have a photo of my Louis Vuitton, there it is right there, my Louis Vuitton bandolier speedy, it's not a speedy, but it's a size 45. Honey, girl, baby, child. When I tell you <laughs> that I wanted that size 45 so bad and for so long I drooled over the size 45, it was like I was telling myself, if I get the 45, my collection will be happening and I'll be so happy with it. I wanted that si size 45 for so long that eventually I ended up asking my sweetheart for it and it was a gift from him. I needed it so bad. I was like, I need it to travel. There's no other way I could travel to visit my sister in New York, or there's no other way I could travel on a trip to Disneyland or anywhere without that speedy 45. I had to have it, you girls. And of course, I have always watched some of the handbag channels like Jerusha Couture, Shay Whitney, and different people in the handbag community. And I said to myself, they have the size 45. They talked about how nice it was. I would like the size 45. So I talked to my honey, and of course that was a bag that he ended up treating me to, and then I eventually ended up purchasing the size 50 right here as well, because I wanted to have the set when I travel, the lovely size 45, and this is the size 50 right here. So the 45 is nice. You can carry the 45 on an airplane. It can go above you as a carry-on bag. This is the lovely size 50, and the size 50 is nice for traveling. Now this one can't go in the over high, over, overhead compartment on an airplane. You have to go ahead and check this one. Most of the time when I travel by road trip is when I carry my Louis Vuitton duffels or key balls. Most of the time, if I'm doing a road trip, I carry my Louis Vuittons because I don't really wanna check those on an airplane flight. You know, so if I'm on an airplane, a lot of times, if I'm going to check my bags, I'll choose to carry another type of luggage. But for road trips, the Louis Vuitton key balls and duffels are so, so nice for road trips. So today, I just wanted to talk to and serenade you lovely ladies with a ludicrous song. The ludicrous song I'm talking about is uh, Lover and Friends with Usher and Ludacris. That's another song that I love. I'm not going to sing that one, though. <laughs> the one that I ended up serenading you girls with was the Wale song with Usher and Wale. Check that song out. It should be on your playlist anytime you and your honey are having that special night. Along with some Sade, of course, you got to have some Sade on your playlist. But definitely check out The Matrimony with Usher and Wale. That right there is a collab that's just so nice. As well as check out Usher with Ludacris and that song Lover and Friends. I like that one as well. So today, you lovely ladies, since I talked about the hubs and since I talked about the man in my life, I wanted to open this up as a tag video, and I'm gonna name this tag. Now, I haven't done a tag video in about six months, and I normally wait a whole year, but it's been six months, you guys, and I figured it's a way for us to have fun in the handbag community. So I'm gonna go ahead and start a handbag tag, and I'm gonna name my tag the Baby Baby Please handbag tag, <laughs> because you know you was like begging and pleading, Baby Baby, please buy me that bag. <laughs> so I'm gonna name the tag the Baby Baby Please handbag tag, and I'm gonna start by tagging just a few of you ladies and gentlemen. I'm gonna tag Bits and Bags. Hi, Tanya, shout out to you from Bits and Bags. I'm gonna tag Robin Cookie. I love her video so, so much. So I'm gonna go ahead and tag Robin Cookie. Uh, let me see, Devin Christopher, 
Debbie's Dilemma, and a few others. I'll go ahead and list everybody down below. I'm trying to go ahead and tag some people that I haven't tagged ever before in a handbag tag, but this tag is open to everyone. Anybody in the handbag community can go ahead and do the baby, baby, please handbag tag, because you know we all begged for that bag before, <laughs> and I'm just playing. It's just, you know, a play on words. I know we all, like I said, work hard for our money and buy our own bags, but we're here to have a little bit of fun today, so make sure you go ahead, like, comment, and subscribe on this video, as well as I'm going to be waiting. Give me a DM on Instagram or contact me some type of way if you decide to participate in the Baby Baby Please handbag tag, and I'll see you ladies in another video. I'm going to be looking forward to seeing all your handbag tags and seeing which bags you convinced your significant other to purchase for you. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. I love you guys. I'll see you in another video.